The Montana State defense continues to shine under new defensive coordinator Freddie Banks as they created four turnovers against Cal Poly. And over the last two weeks, they've held their opponents to only 14 points. Those takeaways, in particular the ones down on their end, were uh, we're huge and you know we were able to do enough things to get a you know build up a 35 nothing lead at halftime up seven to nothing Montana State gained all the momentum on an interception by senior defensive back Tyrell Thomas Montana State then scored a little over a minute later to go up 14 when they get a turnover or anything we just got to go score and put points on the board so I think we definitely feed off each other and we make each other better in practice, so it's, it's fun to see. Thomas returned to the lineup after missing every game this season due to an injury. It was just exciting to have Tyrell out there, and I was just telling him, just let it fly and just do what you do, really. And then, as you see, that's what Tyrell does on an everyday basis. Another player who got an interception was free safety Jeffrey Manning Jr., his second of the year. Head coach Brent Vegan values Manning's consistency. We need our, our free safety to be able to cover a lot of ground and tackle the football, and Jeff's been able to do both of that. Callahan O'Reilly scored the first defensive touchdown of his career on a 39-yard interception return to begin the third quarter and put Montana State up 42-0. to Obviously, anytime you touch the ball, you want to score, so that's definitely better than the last one, and it just feels good to get. We preach takeaways all week at practice, so to get out there and get one always feels good. Although the defense is playing extremely well, they know plays were left out on the field, and they can get even better. I think all we can really do is just hone into our preparation and just execute at the highest ability that we can. At Bobcat Stadium, John Miller, MTN Sports.